This video will take you through the steps to get you up and running with Easy Drummer 2 as fast as possible. A quick note before we get started, the computer in which Easy Drummer 2 is installed does not need to be connected to the internet. As long as you have access to the internet on a separate computer and a way to transfer a file from one computer to another, you'll be fine. The first step is to locate the serial number for Easy Drummer 2. The serial number will be provided to you by the dealer from which you've purchased. The next step will be to log into your ToonTrack account and register your serial number. If you don't have an account, please create one on ToonTrack.com. Registering the serial number to your ToonTrack account gives you access to all of the available downloads for your product and securely links your purchase software to your account. If you purchased Easy Drummer 2 directly from ToonTrack.com, the serial number will be automatically registered to your ToonTrack account. Once the serial number has been registered, you can download and install the full version of Easy Drummer 2. When Easy Drummer 2 has been installed, please launch it using the standalone application or launch Easy Drummer 2 as a plugin in your host sequencer. When the software is launched, this dialog will appear. This dialog is ToonTrack's online authorization system. The online method can only be used if your computer is connected to the internet. If your computer is not connected to the internet, you will need to use the offline method, which we will cover later in this video. In the online authorization screen, carefully enter your ToonTrack.com account email and password, and then click Login and Continue. Easy Drummer 2 will then display the serial number that you have registered to your ToonTrack.com account. Click the Use button, and the serial number will be added to the Serial Number field below. Alternatively, you can paste in your Easy Drummer 2 serial number if you have not yet registered it to your ToonTrack.com account. Then, enter a description of the computer on which you have installed Easy Drummer 2. This can be any name or description that you choose, and it will help you keep track of your authorizations in the future. Finally, click Authorize. Easy Drummer 2 will now be ready for use. If your computer is not connected to the internet, it will be necessary to use the offline mode of authorization. Simply click the offline button and you will see the offline authorization screen. Next, get a piece of paper and write down the computer ID that appears in Easy Drummer 2's offline authorization window. The computer ID is a unique code generated by Easy Drummer 2. The computer ID is not your computer serial number. The only way to access the computer ID is to install and launch Easy Drummer 2. Then access the internet from a different computer and log into your ToonTrack.com account. Go to your list of products. Select Easy Drummer 2 and click Add Computer. Here you will be prompted to enter the computer ID that you previously wrote down. You will also need to enter a description of the computer on which you have installed your Easy Drummer 2. This can be any name or description that you choose, and it will help you keep track of your authorizations in the future. Finally, click Authorize. The authorization file will then appear. Click the Download button to download and save the file. This downloaded file will now need to be transferred to the offline computer in which Easy Drummer 2 is installed. This can be done by putting the downloaded authorization file on a USB flash drive or any other removable storage device. Next, connect the flash drive to the offline computer and launch Easy Drummer 2. In Easy Drummer 2, click the Offline button, then click the Select button and navigate to the location that you save the authorization file. In this example, I've simply left the authorization file on the flash drive. Finally, click Authorize. Easy Drummer 2 will now be ready for use. Once Easy Drummer 2 has been authorized, the downloaded authorization file can be safely deleted, as it is not needed by the program any longer. Saving the file will not allow you to authorize Easy Drummer 2 on any other computer. Each authorization file is unique to one specific computer. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoy using Easy Drummer 2.